Hi, welcome to the YouTube channel. Let's make an eagle. And when you use pieces of paper and you glue it down, it's called a collage. Ooh, hold the scissors like this when you walk around. Let's put your fingers in. First thing we're going to do is we're going to cut out some large, big pieces of paper. And I want this big pieces of paper for something else, so don't crumple them up. Ooh, look at this. This is kind of fancy. I'm wiggling the scissors back and forth. I'm not opening and closing them like an alligator's mouth. I'm just wiggling them back and forth. Awesome. Can you try to do that? Ooh, let's cut away some big pieces first. I'm going to cut near this, but not cut it out yet. Awesome. Let's go ahead and cut along there and then cut near it. And I'll wiggle in a minute. So I want these big pieces because we can use them for something else. So don't crumple them up. Great. Ooh, this is interesting. I'm going to cut in and I'm going to cut again. Oh, be careful of your fingers. Know where your fingers are when you go into this, like a V, into this area. But this is the best way to cut out this type of shape is to go inwards. And also, when I cut, it's about halfway into the scissors. It's not the very, very end of my scissors, if that makes any sense. And I'm not closing it all the way. I'm very slowly closing it. Ooh, hold on to it and wiggle back and forth. It doesn't have to be perfect. You might make some mistakes. That's okay. So I'm going to go around. This is a great way to practice cutting different types of ways of cutting large areas and small areas and just have some fun with this. We're making an eagle and the eagle has feathers on their wings. So let's see here. Oh, here's the head. Let's cut out the big shape first. I want to hold on to that paper. I can use it for another collage. And let's go ahead and wiggle. Oh, wiggle, wiggle. Let's place it. How do I want it? How do you want your eagle? Okay, so let's get some glue. You might need to shake it. Yeah, just a little bit. Let's turn it upside down and let's do some dots of glue at the end. One, two, three, four, five. Awesome. I put one in the middle. Smooth it out. Smooth it out. And that should work. And I just need about two dots of glue right there in the middle. And I'm going to place it nice and careful. Ooh, I like that. And if you have time, you can go ahead and get a crayon and color in the eye. Maybe make a nest. Maybe make some clouds. Yeah. Thank you so much for tuning in, liking, and subscribing to my YouTube channel. Enjoy.